So welcome to this interview and please tell me, who are you? Uh, my name is Sergei Alexandrov and I'm from Russia, St. Petersburg to be more specific. Where did you study there? Uh, I studied in the university which has a focus on computer science and computer systems. So uh, my major was computer science and uh, the specialization is in embedded system. Mm -hmm. And what brought you to autonomous systems? Well, you can think about embedded system as an autonomous system in many cases and vice versa. So uh, autonomous systems is my um, field of interest. Mm -hmm. And what brought you to study autonomous systems uh, at BIT? What was so interesting about this? Um, BIT is uh, oriented at international students, so we are welcome here and the program is completely in English. Um, also here we have a lot of professors who are really experienced and are in the field, so they have both theoretical and practical knowledge. And that's helpful for students. What do you like about the program? Um, this program is very research oriented, I would say. So uh, we are um, supposed to do two R&D projects besides from our master's thesis. And that is very interesting because first they uh, taught us how to do research. We had a special course on scientific working and then after all they give us opportunity to do research and while doing this research to contribute to some project. For example, we have ongoing projects, uh, European projects, so you can feed there or you can work uh, inside our team, BAT bots, which participate in international competition for robots, uh, RoboCup at home. Or as well, you can contribute to projects at Fraunhofer University, which is the largest uh, application-based uh, institution in Europe. So you have a lot of choices. That sounds very interesting. Did I get you right that you got already research experience as a student? Uh, well, to talk about myself, I was uh, just doing the research at my own with my professor, but I could have been involved in some other project. But my choice was to work with professor. That sounds interesting as well. So what are your future plans? Um, once again, we have a lot of opportunities here. And basically all of the choices which I um, already told, that's the, uh, they're not just one shot. Uh, you do project and you're finished. You can continue to do something inside a project. Or you can go to, you can pursue um, PhD. Is PhD an option for you? Mm, yes, sure. I, uh, well, I haven't decided yet because I'm just in the middle of my master's studies, but well, why not? I like doing research and probably I will continue. Do you think that BIT is a good platform to move on to do a PhD? Sure, because um, I have a choice to go either to Bonn University or to uh, technical University at Aachen and to do research here or just stay in my university. A lot of choices in BIT. So thank you very much for this interesting interview and good luck for your future studies. Thanks.